to the Adventures of Officer Fuzz, where we get to hear stories about our favorite police cap, Officer Fuzz. Stories about safety, about treating others with kindness, and today we've got an awesome story lined up for you about how to use crosswalks correctly. And maybe you've never even used a crosswalk before. Well, today you're going to get to learn exactly how to do it, thanks to Officer Fuzz. But before we get into today's story, I know many of you have been enjoying listening to these stories uh, with your friends and with your family. And one, we would love for you to share that with people, but also we would love to hear from you. What are you liking? What suggestions do you have for us? You can let us know your favorite Pops or Fuzz stories or any uh, feedback or suggestions you might have for us by emailing us at fuzz at fortsmithar.gov. That's F-U-Z-Z, fuzz, at fortsmithar.gov. And we'll get back to you. We love to hear how you're enjoying Officer Fuzz. But today, I brought in my son, Josiah, to say a little bit about what he likes about Officer Fuzz. Josiah, what do you like most about Officer Fuzz? What I like a lot about Officer Fuzz is that he helps make Fort Smith a better place. And that's really good because Fort Smith is a good place, and I like that Officer Fuzz is part of that. Thank you so much, Josiah. I agree. I love Officer Fuzz, and I think he is making Fort Smith a better place. And now, let's go to our story. In the heart of Fort Smith, where the sun shone bright and the busy, hardworking people were on the move, lived a cat unlike any other. His name was Officer Fuzz. With his shiny badge and keen blue eyes, he was the city's very own feline protector. Officer Fuzz had two best friends, Officer Robin and Officer Brad. Together, they patrolled the city in their trusty Fuzzmobile, keeping an eye out for trouble. One morning, as they were cruising down bustling Towson Avenue, Officer Fuzz spotted something that made his whiskers twitch. People, young and old, were darting across the street, not using the crosswalks. Oh, whiskers, Officer Fuzz exclaimed. This won't do at all. Just then, a group of kids were about to dash across the street, not far from a crosswalk. Officer Fuzz knew he had to act. Hold on, little ones. He called out, jumping out of the Fuzzmobile. The kids stopped in their tracks. Their eyes were wide with surprise. Did we do something wrong, Officer Fuzz? One of them asked. Not yet, but I want to make sure you stay safe. Were you about to cross the street here and not use that crosswalk? The children nodded yes. Little Cindy spoke up. What's what's a crosswalk? Officer Fuzz explained. Imagine. The street is a big river filled with huge, speeding snorkel snarfs. Would you want to try to swim across, or would you use a bridge? I don't know what a snorkel snarf is, Officer Fuzz, said Bobby, but I sure don't like the sound of it. I think I'd use the bridge. Exactly, Officer Fuzz smiled. The crosswalk is like a bridge. It's the safest place to cross the street because the drivers know to look out for you there. With that, Officer Fuzz led the kids to the crosswalk. He showed them how to press the button and to wait for the signal light to turn green. When it did, they all crossed the street safely, Officer Brad and Officer Robin trailing behind. Reaching the other side safely, the children gave a cheer. Hooray! Very proud of you all, Officer Fuzz said. Now, can you do me an extra special favor? The children nodded. The safety of you and your friends is very important to me and mine. Officer Brad and Officer Robin agreed. Can you tell everyone that you know how important it is to use crosswalks? You bet, Officer Fuzz, Bobby exclaimed. With that, the youngsters took off, excited to talk about their experience. As Officer Fuzz and his two partners returned to the Fuzzmobile, Officer Robin beamed. You did a great job today, Fuzz. Officer Fuzz gave a modest purr. Just doing my job, Robin. After all, safety is our number one priority. Word of Officer Fuzz's lesson spread throughout Fort Smith. Soon, everyone was using the crosswalks and the city became a safer place for everyone. Officer Fuzz, Officer Robin, and Officer Brad couldn't be prouder. With Officer Fuzz leading the way, the city became a beacon of safety. One crosswalk at a time. 
what an incredible story we got to hear today about Poffizer Fuzz teaching some kids how to use a crosswalk correctly. And I know that I would never want to swim with snorkel snarfs, and I'd never want to cross the street without using a crosswalk. And I think we know why, because that is truly the safest option. So thank you so much, Poffizer Fuzz, for that great advice today. Now, as always, you can find us on YouTube, you can find us on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and there's a lot of awesome resources at fortsmithar.gov slash AOPF for the adventures of Poffizer Fuzz. And like I mentioned earlier, we would love to hear from you. You can email us at fuzz at fortsmithar.gov. Parents, let us know what you're liking. Send us messages from your children. We would love to see those. Maybe you download some of those awesome coloring sheets from the website, color us a picture, and send it our way. We would love to see that. But until next time, remember, always do your best and look for ways to lend a helping hand. <laughs>